and welcome back to TFS Plays Vampire. I'm one, one Lanny. Ah, ah, ah. I am... Ooh, come on, who's your favorite fictional vampire? I'm the vampires no. thrall, Grant. There you go. Not the, not the real vampires. Yeah, yeah, I just, I serve them. Yeah, we can't, we can't talk about them. Gonna load through this gate. Don't you and then we're worry. We're gonna walk. This guy had to. This guy. He's so, he's so good at his job. He's so good at getting rid of tails. He threw a loading screen in our way. Ooh, he's yeah. He's he's got those next level strats. Here's what I'll do. I'll have my nefarious deeds. I'll walk through this door and leave a loading screen. Ooh, this area is too big for him to just walk into. He's locked the door behind him. What a clever bastard. Starting to him. feel like a Skyrim dungeon. He's locked this door too. Oh well, <laughs> well guess we should leave. Now we're fucked. When do we get the power to like turn into a bat and then barred doors don't mean a thing? Yeah, when do I get double jump? Or any jump? Oh, I can already... More things. Need all the things. Gimme. Aluminium shards. This man has been savagely attacked and dragged to the floor. He I might wonder be... where he went. He might be dead. Oh, we can open up can that I shortcut. Yeah! Hell Dark yeah. Souls! Now we can get back to this bonfire real quick. Hey, dude. That's one problem solved. Hello? I think I want to change what I'm using. Let's get back to that equipment screen here. So I, I, like, this is nice, but it's actually not as useful as I thought it would be. This stun stake is so much more useful. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. Offhand, right. Hey, dude. Uh oh, oh, he blocked me. Eat him. Om, nom, nom, there nom, we nom, go. Nom, nom. Big gulps, huh? Ooh. Nimbly bimbly. Let's see. Give me your quinine. Quin quinine. Quinine. That stuff. What's up here? Oh, hi. Whoa. That dude was fucking ready. Yeah, he was he was holding an action right there. There we go. Oh shit. Oh, ho, ho. Uh -oh. swashbuckled. Fucking janked, man. Even a hickey on that one. Got lots of blood. Surprised eating the blood doesn't Oh boy, there's there's nope. some there's some physics happening here. It confirms. All right. Two ways to go. I think it wants us to go further down, so we shall. Oh, only level four. Just a baby vampire. <laughs> I just started my vampire journey. <laughs> ah! You're not supposed to eat me. Wow. I knew the vampires were such a huge problem back then. I always laughed at the fact that my grandma has a vampire killing kit from the 18th century. Now <laughs> I guess now, it's just kind of a thing, you know? Now it just seems like who didn't have one? Ah, the sewer beast. <gasps> oh, it's the sewer dog! What sort of creature is this? So is this just my worst nightmare coming true with it's like, yes, vampires are real and that means werewolves are also yeah. real. How could they not be? Oh, 
Oh, I got. Aha! Now I'm a vampanthrope! <laughs> Too bad I have nothing made of silver. Alright, so this is like boss two, I guess. I think this is the, yeah. I feel like werewolves never get to be like the main threat in a story anymore. It is always like, and then we've got my werewolf lackeys. Yeah, I mean, the last movie I saw that had like anything to do with like, van like werewolves even being a threat at all was like, I think it was like the Underworld series. Which wasn't bad, like it's some pretty good action stuff, but they obviously, like, they definitely got worse as they went along. Did you ever watch them? I never watched any of them, actually. I, I always saw the trailers for them and thought they looked cool, but just never had a group to go see them with. I'd say the first three are pretty all right. Oh, shit! Oh, boy! You got the grab on me. Looks like he can bite, too. Seems that way. Doesn't even need to stun me. It's kind of unfair. I don't appreciate that. I don't know, I'll show you how to bite! I got fangs for a reason. Like a stock bear sound effect. I guess. There we go. Just give him all of it. Give him the combo. He has the my wombo. blood magic. I'm glad the stun bar doesn't just recover out of nowhere. Yeah, that would be bad. I, I need my blood back. Wow, not too very much damage. Yeah, it doesn't do a lot of damage, but it's like about resource recovery more yeah. than anything is what I figured. Oh, oh, okay, I actually need to heal. Oh, out of stamina, out of stamina. Made a mistake, mistakes were made. All right, there we go, that's a health potion. Boom. Punch him in the face. I wonder if I get bonus points for killing him with a uh, bite. That's a good question. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh, I might have gotten greedy. Ah, fuck it. I'll just kill him with the machete. We'll find out. Oh, he gained health from that. That's bad. There we go. That should finish him. Fuck me! It should finish. There yeah. we go. All right. That'll learn you a thing or two. And a Let's... week a week ago, you were a yeah, normal hematologist. Fair. Yeah. Well, I'm that's granted normal fair. hematologists just don't go running around in the sewers looking for sewer dogs. Uh, that's fair. Good old Johnny the sewer dog. Joey Bishop, we calls him. Uh, if you are sick, if you have no money. Whoever you are, wherever you're from, come see Dorothy to get help. No tricks, no charges, no questions asked. So I guess that means she's not fucking him because, you know, no tricks. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. mm. And then it says the same thing, but in French. Okay, so so is this the guy that we just saw Some come downstairs? Free check up I guess. Because he was given a note what that would give him free treatment. Out. Man, that thing I stripped really it to the bone out. quick. Yeah. So are we led to believe that that's a vampire, or is it a werewolf? Like, unclear. So uh, maybe vampirism is like stage one. Mm, maybe. Yeah, so maybe it is like the Yarnum disease. Maybe. Got too much beast blood in him. Yeah, he uh, he took a bit too much, and now he's all hairy. Think of like, okay, so you know the 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 old wives' tale was if you masturbate too much, your hands get all hairy. Okay. Drinking blood is like a full but full body masturbation. Oh man, so like just that if you intense. Do it too much, you become a werewolf. Careful, the endangered citizen may not survive the next night. <gasps> Go check on him. I mean, someone's dying. Was it the man, the skeleton we pulled this note off? Is of, it the man who's else? getting attacked? No, I think he'll live. Uh, He's he fine. Knows. He's got a cage between him and them. Okay, there's a there's a. 
Hold on, eating your so, friend. Is that one nurse just like, she just have a racket where she sends guys down here with a, don't worry, you'll get free treatment. Just take the shortcut through the sewer. And that's where her pet werewolf lives. Or does she have no idea that every man I've sent to the hospital for, for, for free treatment ever gets there? She must be like somebody's thrall or something, because I can't imagine it's the werewolf's thrall. Maybe the maybe that werewolf was like one of the vampire's pets. Yeah. Okay, Oswald, chill out. Oi, oh. I don't read much and I hate hospitals. Please save me. That's all we know. I think this is a different guy. Are you injured, oh. sir? Help me get out of here. I need to get out. I'm Dr. Reed. How'd you get here to begin to with? You, but you must calm down first. Please, take a deep breath and tell me your name. Okay. Okay, I, I, I'm Oswald Thatcher. Please, I need to get out. All right, Mr. Thatcher, you're safe now. Do you think you can reach the street by yourself? Yes. Yes, I do. Good. Now leave this place and enjoy the cool night air. It's quite invigorating. <laughs> what? I'm sure you'll feel better if you... Come on, man. Just breathe in the streets of London. Also, I have nothing else also, to say Also, bleh! <laughs> All right. I need to smell you. Wow, just throw him back into a brick wall. Nice. Enjoy the cool night air. Bleh! Oswald may have had a very important storyline that we're now infecting. You know what? I tell you this in uh, good confidence. He doesn't have a good storyline anymore. Yeah. We'll meet again soon. Oh. And we will be serene and beautiful. See? Now we've learned. Something. Now we know something about Newton. There's something about Newton. Look, it's been forever since we ate. No, that's fair. And this guy, he's just down in the sewer. Who's going to miss him? They're going <laughs> to discover him with, like, two vampire corpses and be like, oh, I guess well, the vampires ate him. Who could figure out this mystery? That, that not... Oh, it's a load screen. Gotcha. What if he was a love interest and we just cut him down? Oh, we could have... We just ate our gay lover? Yeah. Man, nah, man. I'm, I'm all about that Swansea life. <laughs> Okay. You're on vampire he, hunter he does X vampire. Treat us right. He does see us for who we are. He gave us our own office, and he's a, he's our biggest fan. So he knows more about us than we do. Mm. He's told us everything we know that's, about that's us. That's true. He is the one who tends to introduce new concepts to us. I just can't wait for later in the story when they're like, man, my friend Oswald was down in the sewer, and if he was here, he'd be able to bring you, like, the newest, hottest, greatest machete that could insta-kill any vampire, but he never showed up, never made it to the meeting point. He discovered the secret to making pure blood just out of nothing. See, I can see how you can confuse just this person here for just any normal this guy. This is just a crazy man it's living just, under a bridge. Yeah, crazy, crazy bridge man. It's like Danny DeVito from Always Sunny. Just living oh. under the bridge. Now let me see that stun All right. Yeah. <laughs> Give him that axe handle. It's, it's Bart hitting Homer with the chair, but just they forgot to put the chair in there. All right. That's taken care of. Pop. Oh, I thought that said popular. What? How do you even? <laughs> what gives me away? <laughs> Well, if they weren't sure before, you started teleporting around with wisps of night behind I you. I wasn't doing that before! Also, these guys are fucking strong. <laughs> this is what you get for eating that guy! I guess? Holy shit, that guy's huge! We sent off bloody uh, our mate Oswald was down in the sewers! Expert vampire he what is! All right, all right, we'll just uh, Ah, fucking! <laughs> so, I'm zoned out of that area, I guess. All right, we're good. We're good. Evening. How are we doing today? Hey. Have you seen my mate Oswald? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed of the Pembroke Hospital. May I be of assistance? Dr. Reed. 
Oswald. What's with folding bullet holes? Oh, wait, it's you who saved my friend Oswald? <laughs> How do you know about him? Oswald. What? Yes, I saved him and brought him to the new light. Oh, this, this How do you know about Oswald? <laughs> How do you know about any of this? What happened? Tell me about your life in London. Did they really not expect me to eat him? Well, oh. Go to the hospital. You Maybe are you just. Always welcome I don't know. At the Pembroke Hospital. As a former officer, How would he know about that? Well, I think you rescued him when you killed those guys. Well, yeah, sure. So I, that I said something. sent out like some like. AI global message of like Oswald equals like rescued in conversation now, and then you went back and undid the rescue, and there's no there's no global message for that. So the game now just, AI accepts Oswald equal rescue. Okay, well I did a good. How do you feel about him? How do you feel about Oswald Thatcher? You are more than friends. Was he the gay option? Well, he might have been. I love Oswald. Ew, we drank gay juice. Uh oh. But I am terrified, I mean, Doctor. Come on, in some places. So much. What if people find out? Oswald says I'm ashamed, but it ain't that. It's more, well, you know. Never thought I'd love a man. What about your father? Enjoy your love. Oh, no. Enjoy your love. I put a couple Enjoy extra holes in him for you. <laughs> Don't let anyone tell you who you should love or how you should love them. I appreciate your kind words, sir. But it ain't that easy. Well, not anymore. <laughs> Unless you're a necrophile as well. Suddenly this game takes a really dark turn you when Oswald's Oswald lover says, Oh, you ate him? You should probably get yourself checked. Tell me about and then it. walks yeah. down the alley. It was last summer. A shell hit our trench and we were buried for a week. Wow. Uh-oh. Oswald seemed traumatized. I can tell because yeah, he tasted uh, a little stressed. Yeah, things he you he might not be Oswald like you remember him, far John. More traumatized than you by the event. It wasn't the first time it happened to me. But surviving it again gave me strength. Do you believe that? How did you survive for a week? Well, well we us, ate humans. Ah, <laughs> uh, little do we know there when to go. <laughs> Since then, well, when Oswald became a vampire 80 years ago, I never mentioned which war, did I? <laughs> All right, well, we've learned a lot about our last meal today. Take care of yourself. Is that Clay Cox? Good evening, Mr. Cox. Yeah! He's looking much better today. Not, I see. I like that. And why is that? People who don't sleep at night always seem more alive to me. More interesting. How ironic. Uh. I don't got no hints about Clay Cox. Do you ever think about that poor fellow I saw you push in the water? The wound he gave me will make sure I don't forget him. Still fucking hurts. Boss, you cut me good. Did he want revenge? Did he, why did he try to kill you? I recently had to kill his brother. So okay. Poor asshole thought it would be easy to return the favor. I'll eat this guy eventually. I I feel I feel bad calling anybody a monster, really. Uh, <laughs> At this point, I just I just ate a man's lover. You know, it feels survival at all costs. Only the strongest survive. Then survival at all costs. Is that all you think about? I'm the toughest bastard you'll ever meet, Dr. Reed. And I'll tell you Ah, what have you seen those guys who are like down the street hunting vampires? They seemed really tough. Yeah, that dude just kicked the shit out of me. Um. How's your hospitalization going? Seem like your you're out. How's your time at the hospital been treating you? Place with shitty stuff. But as long as I'm treated all right, I'll be fine. All right. That's a... Uh, What's wrong with the staff, What's though? wrong with the Pembroke staff? That bastard you sent to bring me here, Milton. I thought he was going to break all my bones before I reached my bed. I see. He only broke half Any of them. smart comments? It's okay, the so Milton abuses uh, patients. Especially that foxy one, Nurse Crane. 
pretty brunette, tough attitude, or like that. All right. He's got a thing for Crane. Let's see. I think I unlocked a personal question. There we go. How long do you think you can answer me, mortal? <laughs> I know this city like the back of my hand, Doc. I know its streets, who to pay, who to avoid. Yes, but did you know that I'm a vampire? <laughs> 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 we can't escape the consequences of our actions. The past catches up with us in the end. I ain't afraid of death. I'll die hard who I So Oswald, who was living nothing but a happy course, life and had been accosted a, against <laughs> his own volition. It's a man we ate. I'm the this guy. The wet no, we <laughs> let him live. Day, we want this meat to like, we, we, want, we want this meat to like <laughs> marinate in his <laughs> <laughs> evil. Yeah, we need to. We need to let this age a little bit. Now let's see his details real quick. See, he's already up to 490. We're getting up there. Clay intended to remain a gang leader after Can we his hover recovery. Can uh, hint locked? Does it tell us anything about what we need to do to figure the it out? The blood quality of the citizen is largely influenced by the health of number of hints. Yeah, okay. so. The more we know about these people, the better they taste. I wasn't sure. He's a little fatigued. We should we should uh, heal him a bit. Yeah, give him some meds. Yeah, where is a uh, medical check? You're lucky to be alive, Mr. I hope you're starting to take better care of yourself. This place is full of sickness and decay. How could I get better in such a dump? Oh, I don't have it. Well, I'm not giving you medicine we'll right you now because I don't have it. <laughs> Fairly well. I'll leave you for now, Mr. Cox. All right. Got a lot of XP, but I'm still not quite done with this mission here. Yeah, and we don't. Now that I know that leveling up makes time pass, it makes a little me, more nervous about yeah, it. Yeah, it makes me more cautious about just going like, "Oh, we got enough to level up. Let's go!" It's kind of a, it's kind of an interesting no, system I, there. I actually like that a lot. Like that's, that's one of the most interesting things this game has, at least in my opinion, done so far. It's like, do you want to level up and risk some shit happening out there, or it makes you really need to think before you spend your XP, which yeah. not very many games Ooh, do. Ooh, this place is serious. Are we, are we like way too level for this, or too low level for this place, or is I this... I don't know, man. It's a really serious place. Let's figure it out. We'll have to explore it next time on TFS Plays Vampire. Uh